Hey guys, how's it going? Zombie back with some more of The Walking Dead Season 2. We uh, finished Episode 2 and we're going to move on to Episode 3 here. And we're hopefully we'll see where this goes. I don't know, I don't know how this is going to end up. All I know is that uh, Carver was... All I remember is Carver was taking us hostage technically and Luke is the only one that isn't in the situation so far previously on the walking yeah, this will this will let me know <laughs> who do you think did this think about it you're Carver what do you do what's the most important thing in this world Clement's family people like Matthew aren't coming back what the fuck, man? Okay, let me adjust. Jesus Christ, this is just obnoxious. I hate, I hate when it does this, guys. I'm, I apologize. It does this all the fucking time, and I, I I'm just tired of it, man. I'm ready to just freaking toss this thing out the window. Come on, man. My capture card's being weird. Sorry, guys. Hold on. There we go. Let me see if that fixed it. Okay, there we go. Okay, it should be fixed. Sorry about that, guys. It, it, it messes up all the fucking time for some reason. It should be better and won't, hopefully won't happen again. Rebecca, our baby deserves to be raised in a place of safety. Ah! Go to hell, you fuck. Oh, uh, yeah, that's... We're right. going home. As a family. You got done over there? Yeah, one second. Thanks for coming with me. It's scary out here. I know they made you. It's still nice that you came. We're friends. Friends look out for one another. We are, aren't we? Well, if you need to pee, let me know. I'll keep look out for you, too. Uh, okay. Come out all right, girls. Troy, get him tied up. Will do. Well, we're on our way. Probably 30 minutes out. Make sure everyone's prepped. Emotions might be running high. Carve her out. If I find out you've been wasting fuel to keep that fucking heater going, I'll make you walk back. Nope. Froze my ass off. Just like you told me to. It ain't polite to listen to other folks' conversations. Has anyone ever taught you that? Where's your manners? I used to have a walkie-talkie like that. Oh, really? Well, what happened to it? Because you can't have this one. I used it to talk to my parents. Is that why you're looking at this one? Do you want to call mommy and daddy? I don't need it anymore. My parents are dead. Everybody's parents are dead. And that don't make you special. My dad's alive. And we're all grateful for that. Get the girls in back with the rest of them. We got a bit of a drive ahead of us. I already don't like this guy. He's just being a dickhead. In. Are you guys okay? The hell did he do to you? Hey! Did he hurt you? Hey! Hey! Yeah, 
And he is protective, but he's just, I think he's overdoing it a little bit. Do something. Boom. Come on. Anyone got anything sharp? Anything? We need to get these bindings off. Hey, Clem, help me find something to get these off. Anything sharp that could cut these. And what good is that gonna do? The hell is wrong with you people? We gotta get out of here. The truck's empty. First off, we're in it, so it ain't exactly empty. If you don't want to help, then just say so, okay? I'll do it myself. We're in a fucking precarious position here. We gotta do something about Settle that. Settle down, Kenny. They took everything. We have to keep a level head. He's right. You don't know Bill like we do. Bill? This whole time it's Carver, Carver, Carver. Now he's fucking Bill? Oh, I see what it is. Y'all are just getting a ride home, aren't you? That's what's going on here. Say that again. I'd stay out of this, boy. Mister, I ain't a boy. No, right. You're a man. You don't understand. He's different. It's worse. The fuck are you talking about? He wants to punish us. Is he... Is he gonna kill us? I don't think so. He ain't gonna get the fucking chance. You have no idea what you're dealing with. Oh, he gave me a pretty good goddamn idea back at the lodge. And I don't intend to sit around here and let that happen to the rest of us. I'm trying to help. I'm sure Walter really appreciated your help. That's not fair. You're blaming him for the actions of a madman. I am pointing out that regardless of intent, there are consequences to rash actions. Something that he seems to be misreading as capitulation. I don't know what the fuck you're saying, but I know it's bullshit. We have to do something. Kenny, you can't reason with him. Oh shit. Jackpot. Sit down. You're going to get us all killed. Y'all don't know what you're talking about. We get cooped up in some kennel like a bunch of fucking dogs. It's over. You don't know that. Yeah? Well, I've been in this situation before. You ever been a prisoner? We've all been prisoners. Why do you think we left? I'm not gonna say anything. All right. Now we're talking. Carver will be on the other side of that door with ten people. <laughs> there, there, baby. It's okay. Everything's gonna be fine. At this point, maybe Luke is the only hope we have. If he was gonna do something, he'd have done it by now. Who knows what he's dealing with? Anything can happen out there. I'll tell you what happened. He abandoned us. You don't know that. I know he ain't here. He may not be around, but he wouldn't just leave us behind. Luke will help would. us. Oh yeah? When? After that crazy fuck's killed us all? Hey, look, Clem. Close. Okay, let's do this. They have guns. What exactly do you expect to do? I'm gonna punch the first son of a bitch I see. Then I'm gonna take his gun and use it to shoot the next son of a bitch I see. Just sit down. Shut up, Doc. This ain't your call. Hey, just, if something happens, just help out, okay? Don't, you know, get yourself hurt or nothing, but any help would be good. Hey, Clem, look at me. You trust me, right? Kenny, please, just, uh, just listen to them. I guess. Yeah, okay. I trust you. I'll, I'll do what I can. All right. It's okay to be a little scared, but we gotta do this. All right. Everybody, ready? Kenny! Uh, Kenny, are you okay? Is he okay? I think so. Oh, That's probably for the what best. What hit me? It's probably for the best. <laughs> I just said that. <laughs> Oh my goodness, God it's damn sad how I know. For shit. All right, up and at him. The fuck? How'd you get your restraints off? Come here. We've got some familiar faces back with us tonight. Now, I understand some of you are confused as to why we bring these people back when they left us as they did. I think I've got an idea. Now, am 
Might not come all at once, but time will heal these wounds. So be patient with them until it does. And take solace in knowing that they're here to help us make our home a better place. All these feelings you have of anger, betrayal, hate, they're all valid. No one needs to forget what they did. But we do have to find it in our hearts to forgive them. Look how much food they have. Oh, I hope you ain't saying what I think you're saying. As many of you already know, a large herd of lurkers gathers just south of us. Come on, we need you for something. Can I wait until morning? We're all exhausted. Just come the fuck on. I need him. I need my dad. I, I can't. He's... He looks after me. They have been taken into consideration. However, this is not up for debate. The expansion project will move forward. He'll be back. When? I don't know, but he will come back. Thanks, Clem. And with the added I'm not gonna hurt him. They need him. He's the only the doctor. Make sure y'all stay off the fence. Bill can see no if you're messing with it. Just to survive. It's our obligation to make this community a beacon of hope. Thanks, Bonnie. Yep. To provide a light, a bright light, bright enough to shine in all this darkness. So that is what we'll do. Y'all best get some rest, because there ain't gonna be much for you tomorrow. You're gonna be working hard. That's for you. Yeah, it would be. Fucking Bill. Keeps me out in the cold. But at least I'll be comfortable. Hey, guys. Reggie! <gasps> I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. What did they do to you? This could have been worse, trust me. I'm lucky to be alive. It's my fault. No, it's really not. I would tell you if it was. This happened well after you guys left. I guess I should say Reggie helped us you, but when we ran away. I know. I feel the same way. What happened to his arm? I don't know. We were all running out together, but then he fell, and everybody kept running. I know he had both his arms then. Hmm. They got me working got outside. Bit. Lurker snuck up on me while I was hammering something. Luckily, they took the arm off quick. Saved my life. That's awful. I'm so sorry. Look, it was my choice to help you guys. Alvin, Carver wants you in his office. What? Don't Why? Shit. Don't make this difficult. It's too late for that. No, please. It's okay, Beck. Just get some rest. If he wanted to do something to me, he'd have done it already. I'll be fine. Let's see what he wants. I don't think he, you will be fine, bro. Hey, I think Rich. you're about to get oh. fucked up. Hey, Troy. Don't go fucking up now. Bill's real close to letting you out of here. You make sure things stay nice and quiet out here tonight, and I'll be sure to let Bill know just how helpful you were. Yeah, you can count on me. Thanks, Troy. Don't mention it. All right, let me introduce you. We were with them when we got caught. Hey, I'm Reggie. That's Sarita. Hello. And that's Kenny. Hey. Uh. Hello. Who are you? This freaks you out. My name's Clementine. It's very nice to meet you, Clementine. Hey, where's Carlos? Bill's already got him looking at some folks. Oh, okay. Good. What about Pete? Can you guys save it for the morning? Some of us gotta be up early. Who's that? I don't know. I don't recognize the voice. No problem. Sorry about that. Okay, that's Mike. He's kind of a dick when he's tired. But, like I said, he saved my life, so... I put up with that shit. Bill put him to work outside the wall with me. I'm so sorry. Stop with all the sorry. It was my choice. Besides, he said once you were all caught, he'd let me rejoin the group, so I'm glad you're here. I'm just joking. I know. I mean, he did say that, but I'm not happy about it. Who's she? Hmm? Who? The girl over there. 
Oh, yeah, right. Okay, so she's fucking weird. They found her sneaking around outside the camp covered in guts and just, like, the grossest shit. It's probably best not to stare. I know how it must look, but it's really not that bad here. Reggie. No, I'm serious. Where else are you going to find food like we have? We've got the canned stuff, and now with the greenhouses coming along, we've got fresh food. The building's getting more and more secure all the time, mostly through forced labor, but that's only temporary. They've even got the solar panels working. When was the last time you had electricity, huh? Well, we just came from a lodge with a wind turbine. It's not a competition. I'm just saying, it's not as bad as you think. We're building something great here, guys. A real community. Bill is making it happen. Look, I've made mistakes, and he's forgiven me. That doesn't make up for what he's done, Reggie. Carver killed my friend Walter. Okay, I, I don't know what happened. But maybe he had his reasons. His reason is he's a crazy piece of shit. Listen, I'm really close to getting let back into the group. Once that happens, I can do a lot more to help you guys be more comfortable. Comfortable? What do you think this is? I just don't want you to mess things up for me. I've worked really hard to get to this point. Will you please just try not to cause any trouble? At least until they release me. Then, once I'm out, I could help you more. Fine. Maybe even help get you out. Okay, sure. <sighs> Thank you. It means a lot. She don't speak for all of us. No, but if she doesn't want to cause trouble, she doesn't have to. We can at least talk about it more in the morning. Just have a quiet night and chat again tomorrow. I can't believe what I'm hearing. Look, the fact is, Bill had every reason to kill me when I helped you guys, but he didn't. Obviously, I don't know what happened while you were all... Are you kidding me? How is it that it got disconnected? I literally haven't moved. Gone, but he's given me a second chance, Apologies, and guys. I know he'd do the same for you. Reggie, I don't want a second chance. I want to leave with my family. That's it. Your family is safer here. <gasps> I need to sit down. Yeah, come on. Sarah, can you go see if there's something for her to drink? Okay. Yeah, there's water over by the benches. Ah, oh, that didn't go as planned. Should have actually made a plan. Man, fuck that guy. I don't think we can trust him. I mean, clearly, he's already drank too much of the Kool-Aid. I don't trust him either. He acts... strange. Yeah. I guess getting part of your body chopped off can do that to a fella. You gotta take a look around. We gotta know if there's anything we can exploit to get out of here. We're in a tight spot. Gonna have to wriggle our way out. Well, what should I be looking for? Stuff that they don't want us to know about. That Troy asshole's gone for now. This is our chance. Don't worry about Reggie. I'll go help run interference on him. Your eyes gotta be... Walker just Looking snuck up it. on you, huh? Yep, I was uh, distracted. Just wasn't thinking. There was all kinds of noise, hammering and stuff. I saw its shadow. It moved in front of one of our work lamps down here and knocked it over. Couldn't even see for a second. Hello? Get lost. Well done. Fine. Fishy. I like fish statues. I, I, I really do like fish. I actually just came back from an aquarium yesterday. Hi. <laughs> I saw a fella try that a few months ago. Stand it up, bleeding out. Ended up turning anyway. Guess it's better than Yo, the like ground. Said, it felt like my it's not. Did a on Is it though? Is it really? Alright. Hey, clown. Nick? Just thinking about Lou. Just. There's no way he's gone. That he left. He wouldn't leave. How about it? Because me, I've known him for damn near 20 years now, and I can't buy it. Of course, I can't say the thought never crossed my mind. Things change. The whole damn world change. I think you're right. He'd never leave you guys behind. Us guys, you mean? Yeah, us guys. 
Guess I'll try and get some sleep. You should too. They're gonna ride our asses tomorrow for sure. Okay. Night. And that's when I thought I should really get out ahead of this. Hmm. Looks rickety. Looks kind of crappy. You just looking through. This place seems pretty secure. Hey, Clem, come on. Don't be like that. She ain't doing nothing wrong, Reggie. Just relax. How can I relax when she's walking around touching everything? <laughs> I was just testing the integrity. Don't worry about it, man. Oh, wait a freaking minute. I saw that thing. Ouch. You're just gonna look at it, that's it? I... Reminds me of the jewelry store. Oh, because Lee died in a jewelry uh, store, that's uh, right. Clementine, please. I asked really nicely. I don't want hey, to... what the hell is she doing? No, uh, nothing. <laughs> you know, kids. They love not listening. You had one job, Reggie. This is real disappointing. Gonna have to tell Bill about this. Please, come on. Hey, don't be like that, man. You shut your fucking mouth. I don't know you. Oh, you all fucked up now. Bill's gonna hear about this shit. Troy, please. Fuck you, Reggie. This is setting you back a few. Get comfortable, asshole. He was trying to help. She's just a kid. No one's talking to you, Indian lady. Hey! It's hey, fine. Whoa. I am Indian. Everybody get to bed. Some of these folks ain't too keen on leaving. It's up to us to figure out a way out of here. You up for it? It's your decision. I'm ready. Of course I am. Good, good. Confidence is good. You gotta have the right attitude. Now get some sleep. We'll need it. We're gonna pull some, uh, fucking Mason and Reznov shit, Kenny. Hell yeah. <laughs> What? Get up. Bill's gonna have a word. There's been increased walker activity along the fence, so be mindful when outside the walls. The herds moved a little closer as of this morning, but that still doesn't necessarily mean we'll be hit. No, we're monitoring the situation. Now, there are some folks might be sore about what happened and how things went. Well, that's all in the past now. Some of you are new to our community. Some of you are members who went astray. But know that you can find redemption here, forgiveness, by proving your worth through what will undoubtedly be hard work. You know, Reggie slipped up last night, but that doesn't mean he should lose hope. Today will be a test for him. So let's all wish him the best of luck. How'd you sleep? I'll let Reggie be an example I'm to you so all. I'm so tired. Salvation is available, but it I didn't even must be earned. That. 
Kenneth will be taking over Reggie's duties outside the walls, and Michael will continue on I showing just his it value. Nice finally... Carlos! Yes? Your child seems to be in need of correction. I'm sorry. I... Sarah, apologize to Mr. Carver. S I'm sorry, sir. No, no. That ain't gonna cut it. I can't have this kind of behavior on day one of your reform. You discipline her now, Carlos. How do you propose that one I... One good smack across the mouth should do it. It'll make her think twice before opening it up again. Go on, we'll wait. My... I'm not sure with my hand that I... Well, could... that's why you got two hands, Carlos. Come on! Not some mamby-pamby thing, all right? A good hard smack. Otherwise, Troy here will do it for you. I don't think you want that. He can be overzealous. Is that the word? If it means I'll slap the shit out of her, then yeah. It's my fault. Hey, no one's fucking talking to you. Unless you want one of what she's about to get, I'd pipe down, Missy. I'm sorry, Dad. I'm Close sorry. Close your eyes, honey. It's only going to sting for a second. Do it. Knock a kid over like that, I think it's a bit much. I'm sorry, sir. Stop! You're not coddling that girl anymore. Let her sit there and think about what she's done. Troy, yeah, get Carlos to his guy. post. Everyone else should have their assignments. It's time to get to work. God damn. You really knocked the shit out of her, Doc. Everyone get to work. You're working in the armory. Follow me. Soil, coming up! God damn this thing! Oh, shit. Clementine! Whoops. <laughs> Go on inside. Bonnie's waiting. Oh, fuck. Hey, I guess you're starting your day with me. We're loading magazines. Well, that's it. You got it. I suppose I owe you an apology. I wasn't truthful when I came across y'all at the lodge, and I was shown a kindness I never would have expected from a group of strangers. But now folks are dead, and I can't help but feel I'm to blame. But the plan was for no one to get hurt. I truly believe that was the intent. Carver's the one who pulled the trigger. He's to blame. Yeah, but I surely didn't help matters. I thought if I was the one that found everyone, I could control it. Keep everyone safe. But that ain't how it went. I apologize. Which don't account for much, but it's all I can offer right now. How was your first night in the yard? I know it ain't so comfortable, but it's safe. Which is more than I can say about a lot of places out there. You mean my first night in prison? It ain't a prison. More of a work release. Didn't they do those in prisons? Well, I... What? Probably. I don't know. I've never been to prison. Don't tell no one. I'm trying to keep a tough reputation. I was supposed to go. When Luke and Carlos and all them left, I was planning on leaving too. When Luke approached me about it, I, th I thought he was crazy. I mean, we're safe here. We got power, we got food. Why didn't you leave? I mean, if I'm being honest, I guess I chickened out. I justified not going by telling myself it's easier to try and change something that's broken than start all over. Take this situation with the herd? That's the type of thing that rips a community apart. 
He keeps things in line. He's got a lot of this stuff figured out. I don't know. I guess I just wanted to be somewhere comfortable for a while. Nobody's safe here with Carver around. You're safe if you stay on his good side. I would if I knew where it was. I mean, it ain't easy keeping a group this big fed and protected. I don't envy that position. Figured that'd make anyone a little stressed. I'm not defending what he did. That was... <sighs> I'm alive because of him. That's just a fact. Sounds like you really respect him. It's not that. I just have sympathy for the man. Even though sometimes it's hard for him to do the same. Luke had ideas about how things should go, but they didn't line up with what Bill was thinking. They butted heads. Then Rebecca started showing, and that only made things worse. Maybe Luke was right about him. I wish he was around, but I just hope he's safe. Hey, Bonnie, is that girl down there? I need to come get her. Yeah, she's here. Okay, I'll be right over. You were the one that brought I'm me sure here. it's fine. Oh, almost forgot. I grabbed this for you. Oh, boy. Oh, jeez. It's the ugly jacket from the first huh? fucking... Huh? What do you think? I found it at the lodge y'all were at. Think it might be for scan. Had to wait for no one to be around to get it to you. It's cool. I, guess. I like it. Well, I'm glad. I thought it was cute, but I didn't know what you'd think. You better watch yourself. I think some folks might be jealous of that cool jacket of yours. Oh, there you are. What's with the ugly jacket? Tavia. What? Never mm. mind. I'll see you later, Clementine. Come on. Damn. Follow me. Come on. Yeah, what's with the ugly jacket? Oh my god. <laughs> I was trying to be nice. <laughs> Stay in here for a minute. I'm gonna radio down and find out what you're doing. Don't touch anything. Okay. Oh boy. Hey. Are you okay? I know it's... it's gotta be hard. My dad's never hit me before. That wasn't Even him. Even when I was really bad. <laughs> he never hit me. He didn't want to do it, Sarah. Carver made him. He's the bad guy, not your dad. So, in a weird way, Carver's the one that hit you, not your dad. I guess... You really think about it. Carver hit me super hard, because it still hurts like crazy. Yeah, <laughs> it looked like it. Well, thanks for trying to help. I don't know why people have to be so mean. Like, even when I'm really mad, I still don't want to hurt anyone. Some people are just like that. Don't mess this up. Yeah, I get it. Reggie's in charge here, okay? Listen to him carefully. Yep, no problem, Tavia. Okay, we gotta do a good job, guys. The camp is counting on us. Come on, <laughs> I'll show you what to do. It's super easy. Oh, and just so you know, Bill yelled at me this morning for what you were doing last night. I'm not mad, but please, please just listen to me today. I'm on, like, the thinnest ice with that guy. Pick up a pair of those shears. Oh, okay, so we're picking these berries, right? Just pick them, put them in the basket. Simple. While you're at it, if you see any dead branches, take those shears and cut them off and stack them neatly for composting. Got it? Hey, so... Is she gonna be okay? Because what happened down there? That was straight fucked up. I don't want her freaking out and getting me in trouble. I'll take care of her. You don't have to worry. Good, good. Because I'm awful at that stuff. Look, Bill's had it out for me ever since I helped those guys escape, so I gotta concentrate on my work. Oh, jeez. I'm not a dog. That was awkward. 
I won't do that again. I'm going to go work now. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I'm selfless here. I'm gonna. I'm, I'm gonna... Hey. Here, watch me. This isn't that hard, Sarah. I know. I'm just afraid I'll make a mistake. It won't be the end of the world if you do. Just keep going. Ah, oh, shit. Oh no! You didn't do any of your work, Clem. <laughs> Just checking in. See how the new girls are working out. Reggie. Yeah, Bell. Hey. What the fuck happened in here? Look, Bill, they're new, and me with my arm, it's just not the easy... I just have... I have one shut arm... Shut up, so... shut up. Shut the fuck up. You better have an explanation for this. And I mean now. God damn it. Bill, please, just... Sounds just... like you were about to give me an excuse when I asked for an explanation. It was my fault. I didn't show Sarah well enough. I guess. No, this ain't your fault. We talked about this, Reggie. Didn't we? But you just don't get it, do you? Get what? I, I... Why don't you girls wait outside? Reggie and I have a few things to talk about. No, don't, don't do that. You stay in there. Stay in there and fucking... Thanks for the help, God girls. You don't deserve that. What's wrong, Sarah? Are you okay? I no, gave no, you no, plenty no, of chances. Please, Bill. No, 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 please. Ah! Weakness, incompetence, it puts us all at risk and it won't be tolerated. You think about that the next time you're asked to do something. Get downstairs. Bonnie's got some stuff for you to do. Go! Oh, mm. hey. So, they want you to run some supplies out to the guys working at the expansion? Real simple, just take this over to them. That jacket looks real nice. I don't know what Tavia's talking about. What's sure. wrong? Clem? You all right? Reggie. Reggie's dead. What? What are you talking about? Carver killed him. He pushed him off the roof. Maybe... Maybe it was just an accident. No, he literally fucking pushed him off. Listen to me. Take this stuff out to those guys and come straight back. Just be safe, okay? Now ain't the time to be calling attention to yourself. I need to go find out what happened. Hey, Troy! Clem's just gonna take them boys some nails. All right. Go on. Hey! That ain't your concern. Get that stuff over to them boys. Just follow them cables. My concern, yeah, horseshit. I ain't nobody's laborer. Fuck that. Let them do this shit themselves if it's so goddamn important. 
Get your fucking hands off you me, You ain't man. gonna force me to do this bullshit. I said get your hands off me. Or what? You gonna go tail on me? I'm trying to help you, asshole. Yeah, this is a real help. Why don't you just worry about yourself? Reggie's dead. Carver killed him. What? You sure? Or did you... <laughs> Shit! Fucking grab something! Bonk. 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 But how about you know? Stop it. Oh, bad zombie. Bad zombie. You need another zombie. You need another zombie. Moan, spam, evil, maybe. Aha! Hello, Get up. Get out of there. Come on. Make me save your ass. Jesus. Oh, thank God. You're okay. All right. Enough mushy shit. You get back inside right fucking now. I'm sure they got shit for you to do in there. Now! Think I'm fucking around? Now I gotta sit down here and babysit you assholes. Can't do a simple fucking patch job without me here cracking the whip? All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and leave the video off here, guys, because I think now is a good time to just stop. So, if you guys want to see more of The Walking Dead season two here, just let me know by leaving a like, man. Um, we're gonna we're gonna continue moving forward, and we're gonna try to get all this stuff completed relatively quick. Um, I want to get all of the I want to get the rest of this season kind of completed, at least today, and then uh, I will most likely be moving on to the next season immediately after so I can just get all these videos out and so I can have full playthroughs up and everything but I don't know um, comment if you guys want me to play any other games if you guys want to see me do like a playthrough of any other game just let me know I have plans on restarting Dying Light uh, I actually deleted the old videos oh whoa hey whoa oh, what the fuck Hey now, hey now, who the fuck is this? Ah! Uh, who is that? <laughs> I actually did not mean to do that. Um, I was just walking. I did not expect anybody to grab me. I don't know who that is. But we'll find out in the next episode, you know? That, I, I actually did not mean to do that. Um, <laughs> okay, so subscribe if you guys haven't yet. And now you guys have a fucking cliffhanger, of course. Because I, I totally meant to do that. I... Oh my god. I actually did not mean to do that, I swear to god. <laughs> Anyways, I will see you guys in the next video or live stream. Peace out, you guys.